I'm standing here next to the Ford Explorer America, and this is a concept that shows what a future Explorer could look like. The original Explorer really kicked off the SUV trend, and in the 90s, Ford was selling over 400,000 a year of these. The gas price is a little bit higher, a lot of competitive SUVs have come out, and a lot of them are crossovers. They're based on cars. So that's what this future Explorer is going to be, and this concept represents what a unit body crossover Explorer might look like. Under the hood, it's likely to have a V6, and instead of a V8, probably a twin turbo direct gas injection V6, which will get you the V8 type of power with a whole lot better fuel efficiency. Now on the outside, of course, the look is completely different, and Ford wants to do that because that represents the change that's happened under the skin. This doesn't have the truck-like squarish look of the current Explorer, but is a much more organic uh, design. Inside, of course, there's a lot of changes too, and inside this is much more of a concept than it is outside. Whenever you see these seats sticking out from the drive shaft tunnel, that probably isn't going to happen. And it's a very exotic dashboard, but there is an interesting feature there. There's a big section of the dash that's all LCD, and you'll be able to call up all kinds of different displays up there. You might even be able to bring up a snapshot of your kids to watch while you're driving. There's a number of neat details on this Explorer America. It's got two conventional doors on this side, but on the other side there's a conventional door and a sliding door, which makes it a whole lot easier to get into the rear seat or the cargo area. And in the back there's features like this slide-out table and seats that come right out of the bumper, so if you want to have a tailgate party or you're sitting there trying to put your ski boots on in a parking lot somewhere, it's a whole lot more convenient to do so. Now at this point, this machine is purely a concept, but I think uh, if the Explorer is around in 2011 or 2012, it's probably going to look a lot like this car.